All right, it's the moment of truth. Ready to test out the bricks version of my blueprint compared to the oxygen version of my blueprint. And it's very close to an apples to apples comparison. Um, I'll point out a few of the differences. There is a more complex menu here in the oxygen blueprint. And, but then I think that's pretty much it. Uh, I originally I had some more um, more FAQs linked over on the bricks version, but I went and removed that just so it matches. So it's just two as well. So it, it's pretty close apples to apples. And we're gonna go ahead and give it a shot, see what happens. When I tested oxygen originally, uh, that page, this is what I had gotten. I'm gonna run another test again. I did clear the cache and reloaded. And so we're just gonna try it one more time. Or, yeah, we're, so GT metrics. Let's grab this URL. All right, let's see what we got. And while that's coming in, I'm gonna just test this one more time as well. Um, let me grab this URL. I'm assuming it'll be exactly the same as what I had before. But we'll find out here in a little bit. Okay. All right, very good, very good score. 95% 95, 95 performance, 88% structure. And there might be some things I, I missed that I, they need to be cleaned up. Let's look over on the oxygen one as that reloads. Uh, okay, so this was actually about the same. Same as the original one. So I do have a little bit, um, I mean, this is great. You know, these are all green light green on structure. Um, so I'm, I'm very happy with this. This is exciting. I'm curious. I do want to see the uh, the waterfall to see how many resources are loaded. All right. So I've got 19 on the bricks site and have 20 on oxygen. Okay, let's just go through and just maybe just read this a little a little slowly. So don't lazy load uh, large kind of images. Okay, so that might be the hero image is set to lazy load. I guess that's the default setting in bricks because I didn't I didn't change this or anything. So total page size is 480 kilobytes. Font, that's interesting. The fonts are 210 kilobytes because I thought I was using system fonts. So let's go over here and, and check out this summary. So for this, the images are actually quite a bit larger. And so maybe that's because maybe Bricks is lazy loading by default. Um, total page size 418 kilobytes. So overall total page size is, is larger. I don't want to go through, I don't know how interesting this is to go through this in detail or not. Um, but I guess well, let's adjust some settings here in, in Bricks. So I did notice Bricks um, settings, performance. Let's just go through and disable emojis, uh, disable embed. I'm not using Google Fonts. Okay, here's lazy loading. So that must be enabled. Or it obviously is enabled. Query cache or cache query loops. I do have some query loops that are being used. Um, okay. Let's go ahead and clear cache as well and then let's just go and reload um, our incognito window so 
So now lazy loading is turned off by default. So now let's just uh, rerun this. Oops, I don't want to do that. <clears throat> Change this again to San Antonio, Texas. Okay, while well that's running, let's see if there's anything else that stands out about, about this. Obviously, disabling lazy load is probably going to hurt performance. But I wanted to see, because I don't think oxygen does that by default. Uh, I don't have any, I don't have, uh, I can't think of what it's called. Any, uh, hmm. any uh, the performance plugins installed like, um, uh, what can I think of it? Let me, let me look it up here. Flying press. I don't have flying press installed or anything like that. All right, what do we have now? Okay, so now we, <clears throat> performance actually went up to 98% and our structure dropped a couple percentage points. Um, artist painful content improved probably because we're not lazy loading. Although it's still saying it's still saying that hero image is being lazy loaded. We still have fonts <clears throat> is our largest size. So I have font awesome loading. So I do have all these icons loading even if they're not being used. And maybe font awesome wouldn't be loading <clears throat> if I wouldn't have selected it for one of the because uh, uh, these are whatever the default icons are being used but then down here this hand that's the font awesome icon and I'm not sure if I use it anywhere else or not so something from th from uh, Read more or less from that Bricks Extra icon. Okay, so those fonts, I think, are actually icons. Where it says that um, this here, I'm pretty sure those are mostly icons. So there's definitely some things that could be tweaked further but overall this is a fast loading website I mean that's that's fast I, I do have fast internet for sure but that's really snappy so I'm pretty happy with with the performance um, I think I'm gonna go back and and uncheck where are we at here Back to brick settings. Find disabling emojis. I do want to disable Google fonts unless I'm using it. Oh, I didn't disable lazy loading. For some reason, I thought I did. So that would probably... Probably resolve the, uh, the issue with that... Uh, uh, about the image at the top, which ideally I want to lazy load except for things at the top. So, um, but let me just retest it. I'm curious what, what it's going to say this time. <laughs> Still have that warning, uh, but my performance to take a hit, probably because we're not lazy loading most of the things. So I do want to lazy load. Uh, these other things I'll leave disabled. 
and maybe I'll turn this cache query loose. Maybe I'll leave that off. It's an experimental feature right now, so I'm not totally sure what all, if there's any issues with that or not. And then on the on the home page, oops, oh yeah, on the home page, let's see if we can change within bricks, change this hero image from lazy loading. HTML tag. It doesn't look like it. There probably is a way. Um, Okay, there we go. Oh, not a, not an answer. So I'm sure there is a way to do this. It might just be adding a attribute value to the hero image. Okay, I'm not sure exactly, but. Consensus, um, I'm, I'm excited. I think this is a terrific, uh, I'm happy. The performance meets my expectations. It's very, it's comparable, you know, right along with Oxygen. So super excited about that. Um, I guess I did want to check the DOM count. Uh, what do we have over here in Oxygen? I think it would be, yeah, under structure. There we go. What excessive DOM size? So we had 446 elements. Um, perfect. So that's all good. Now let's go over here and look at our structure. Fewer DOM elements, 265. Now, keep in mind, I know that. I didn't have uh, the menu is not as complicated, but that's uh, that's actually a significant not a difference, a really significant difference. So the only thing I need to figure out is how to not lazy load my hero image, which should be fairly simple to do. And let's run. Um, Google page speed page speed insights so this is the bricks and then we'll come over here to do uh, the same thing for the oxygen one okay 98% on mobile again that problem on the first uh, con contentful paint so I think it's again probably because of the hero image being lazy loaded possibly although here it does say eliminate render blocking resources um, bricks assets so maybe eliminating some of the icons might help with that I definitely do need CSS or, or automatic CSS to load. And then so I got great, great score on mobile, perfect score on desktop. Wow, I'm really excited. And we're still running over here. Okay, okay, 98% on mobile, all right. No issue with first uh, contentful paint. 1.4 seconds, what was this here? 1.9. So I think I can get that resolved. 100% on, on desktop. Okay, so this is one thing that can be improved. Uh, adding explicit widths and heights, which the uh, Flying Press plugin does that, or does it automatically for oxygen. I don't know if it does that automatically for bricks. So again, overall, I know I've said it. Overall, I'm super impressed with with Brick's performance. I'm excited. It's a great alternative to Oxygen Builder. 
All right, just jumping back on, uh, I had finished recording and forgot. I wanted to ask, what do you guys, what do you think? Are you making the switch now from oxygen to bricks or possibly something else? Is there more testing you need to do? Drop a comment below uh, with where you're at and what you're thinking moving forward.